Hey everybody, how is it going? It's the Crystal Flaffy, and welcome to today's episode, episode number six of Pokemon Dark Rising, that we're doing a Nuzlocke of, and as you can see that we only have three members on the team. We're not doing so great right now, but that, that should hopefully turn around a bit in today's episode. We're going to go to a new place, get some new encounters. Um, I did grind a little bit between episodes because we lost three Mons last episode. Last episode, three Mons. <sighs> so many fucking Mons, and we lost it all to like one Pokemon too. Or, or yeah, yeah, it was all of that fucking heat more. If you haven't checked out last episode, go check it out. You'll understand what I'm talking about. I'm um, gonna have a small team recap. I don't think the team has changed that much. I don't remember if we learned any new moves. We're just gonna go over the moves, because that's all that would have changed if something did. So we have Postman Argentini, our starter, with Swift, Dragon Breath, Thunder Wave, and Water Pulse. We have Core, our Rogue and Rolla, Rock Blast, Mud Slap, Iron Defense, and Headbutt. And then we have Son Goku with Facade, Rollo, Fire Punch, and Tackle. I think I learned Fire Punch while I was grinding. I think that's the only new move we got. Um, did I stock up on potions and stuff? No, I did not. We have a fuck ton of Pokeballs, though. So let's just grab some potions for the next route for us to go. And so that we can live and stuff, you know? We'll grab 8, get up to a nice round 20. And since we can't buy any more full heals, we'll buy a couple antidotes. Nope, I don't want to buy any more than 3. We'll buy a couple uh, paralyzed heals and a couple burn heals. And do I want to grab an escape rope? You know what? Yeah, just in case there's like a cave or something up ahead. Well, no, just grab one. Just in case there's a cave or something ahead and we are running low on like health and stuff and want to get out quick. You know, I don't know. I don't know, but we're gonna go... Wait, there was... Was there something up here that we could have gone to? Oh yeah, that cave over there. Can we go in there now? Nope, it's still too hot. So I guess we come back here later? I guess? Is there anything else up over this way? Nope, so we're to run on over this way and head to the right. And immediately get into story when I thought we were going to be able to go maybe catch a Pokemon. Um, I don't, I'm going to guess that this is a woman. Because the, the sprite has longer hair. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, anyway. <laughs> Alright, man. To Water's Caverns. Move out. Yes, sir. But see, they could just be saying sir out of respect. Because I know in the, like, the military and shit, you still say yes, sir, even when addressing a woman who's your superior. Doesn't It's not a gender thing, it's a respect thing, I think. I don't know. The movies could be lying. The movies could be lying to me. Sending out this level 12 Growlithe. So we're facing level 12s, and the gym leader that we just fought had a level 20 as as her ace, so... I don't know what's going on here, but we can water pulse this thing. And Oko it. We're twice its level. But it'll give it a small sliver, a decent amount of experience, you know, something that we can grow with, you know. The reason I wanted to grind up to 24 is because I'm just preparing for the next level spike that we come across. I don't want to walk through here and then randomly hit a level 28, you know? Or a battle of level 28 and us still be level 20. And out's coming a Cyndaquil. Again, all these Cyndaquils that we can fight and sh or all these Cyndaquils that we're facing and we missed out on the one opportunity we had to catch one. Ah. I just want something good. Just want something good. Sorry about that. Clicked out of the game by accident. Because, you know, I play it on my laptop, right? And the laptop has the trackpad right where the buttons are, right below the keyboard. So sometimes my thumb, like, hits it or the palm of my hand hits it. And we can come down right over here and get an encounter, but I actually want to try to sneak on over this way and see... Okay, we got to battle so much fucking people in this place. Can we walk under this guy? Yes, we can, but we got our encounter anyway. I wanted to see how far we can go. And it's a Mincino. Mincino. 
which isn't a bad Pokemon, but I want something more diverse type-wise. I don't want a normal type. We can at least paralyze it, and it's going to attract us. We're going to switch immediately, because we don't love these hoes. We don't. Um, and we can mud slap it with core to weaken it. I really wish we got something more powerful. Or not more powerful, just something that is super effective against something else with its stab. Okay, come on. This rain is annoying me. We're just gonna mud slap it a couple times. Okay, more than a couple times. Weaken it a bit. Never mind, it's just gonna be a couple. It's not gonna be more than a couple because it's a track bullshit. <sighs> We're in love. We don't love these hoes. Stop tickling me and trying to get me to love you. It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. I don't love you. I'll love you if you're on my team. If you join my team, then I'll love you. Okay? And it has fucking Iron Tail. It has coverage at least. Can't complain about that. Let's just try throwing a Pokeball here because I don't want to deal with fucking Attract anymore. It's taking too long and my speed up button isn't working as well as it normally does because I am actually rendering episode 4 right, right now. <laughs> I'm rendering episode 4 right now as I'm recording episode 6. I'm a full two episodes ahead of you guys right now. But we caught the Minchino. These Pokemon prefer a tidy habitat. Their ta tails are always kept well-groomed and clean. It's the Chinchilla Pokemon. Um, I, I kind of want to name it Dawn. I think it evolves with a Dawn Stone. But the name Dawn is like really, really appealing to me for this Minchino. Let's take a look at it real quick. Brave Nature. Fuck, that sucks. It has lowered speed. It's supposed to be a fast Pokemon. And it has cute charm, not even skill link. I don't even know if skill link was in this gen, to be honest. Um, we're gonna go back, though, and heal this thing up. Because I'm not trying to die. We're gonna try to use this thing right now. Get it to level up a bit, in case we run into a strong trainer. You know, I was actually going to skip over those trainers right there, but you, we're going to use them for a little bit of grinding right now for for Dawn. That's what we're going to do. So let's put you here, and we got to organize the party accordingly. It's all in order of when we caught what. That's why Dawn is... I mean, not Dawn. That's why Postman is always going to be in the front or the back, because he was the first one we caught. Well, we're given... Hi, I like shorts. They're delightfully comfy and easy to wear. So basically this person just is youngster Joey just with different just with a more eloquent vocabulary right and it's a double battle was not expecting that so we already know we got to fuck up this blitzel real quick we'll double slap and we will nope not tackle we will facade it Oh, please don't tell me they double teamed Don. Okay, I don't think I don't think the Blitzel can take out Don from there, so we should be fine. And this guy's level 16s, right? And the last guy was level 12s. Tell me where that makes sense. Yo, Don, hit all five times. Ah! Oh, it just goes for tail whip. That's fine. That's fine. But hitting four times? No, not roll up. Tackle. That's what I want to do. There we go, get Don some nice experience. Even get Son Goku a little bit. Just a little bit, just a little bit. Alright, well while we brainlessly plow through all these random trainers, who are apparently all gonna be double battles now? Just, I guess? Okay. Oh, uh, Poliworld. It's kinda, yo, drought. Yes, thank you. Weaken those water moves. Make this thing less threatening to me. Um, I'll double slap the Vulpix and also roll it, roll out on it. Just in case the roller doesn't kill, I don't want this thing to get off a boosted 
fire hit on Dawn. But yeah, we'll go through the question of the day now. Um, so recently, I'm gonna speak a little bit leading up into it. Wow, landing hypnosis like that. That's rude. That's rude. Okay, well, just over the past few days, I... No, I don't want to attack... I don't want to attack Dawn. Over the past few days, I've recently got back into drawing. Um, I drew a lot when I was younger, and I would periodically draw every now and then when I was in the mood. And I'd say I'm pretty good. I wouldn't say I'm, like, the greatest or whatever. Definitely wouldn't. But I... I was interrupted. Somebody came in the room. Sorry about that. Um, but I definitely, I bet, I am definitely proud of my ability draw. Um, I used to put my DeviantArt account in the description and stuff, but I didn't really use it much, so I stopped doing that. I'm, I think I'm going to start doing it again, because I did start uploading over there. Over the past two days. I uploaded like two things over the past two days or something. But I really like it. Um, I think I'm somewhat talented in it. So that leads me to ask. What is your talent? Um, wow, the prediction. <laughs> and it even got cute charm. I don't think it works like that. I don't think he's going to still be in love because Minchino switched out. Yeah. Okay. That would have been pretty. That would have been pretty funny though. Yo, wow! Double protect, really? Come on. The reason I switched Minchino out is because I didn't want to get poison pointed and have to go all the way back. Because I'm not wasting those potions and antidotes we got just yet. I'm saving them for when we actually need them. And I think we're gonna do the same this turn. Oh, this guy got four Pokemon. Fuck, man. We'll just double slap. We'll risk it. Really wish it hit more than twice. Because now we have to hit three times to, to... Or not. We can crit. That works too. So yeah, just let me know. What's something that you're really talented? It doesn't have to be art, obvious, or drawing, obviously. Because that's not everybody's talent. Um, it's something that I think that I'm talented in. So I wanted to share it with you guys. And I'm going to put it in the... I'm going to start putting my... DeviantArt account in the description again so that I can start sharing with you guys more, I guess. Yeah. So I just wanted to let you guys know that. Pineco. Oh, we are we are staying in. We are not catching a self-destruct. We are not catching a self-destruct on anybody but Core, who's the only one we have that can potentially live it and with a good amount of health, too. And I actually did not expect Core to outspeed. But Pineco and Fortress are actually really slow, so... I guess it makes sense. I guess. I guess, I guess so. Alright, what level... Do Dawn did level up once, okay. I was like, did Dawn not level up at all? Oh, she just leveled up. So this is going to take a lot longer than I thought it was going to. I wonder what else we could have caught here. I'm gonna be mad if I find out that we could have caught like Totodiles and shit, and we got a Mancino. Who never hits more than twice, or more than three times. Well, no, she did the first time she used it, she hit four, so. Can't really complain there. Sorry, small interruption again. It's fine. To my little sister looking for something, it's cool. It's cool, it's cool. Hopefully, we can get Minchino to learn something new. Maybe, like, Rock Blast or Bullet Seed. Well, probably not Bullet Seed. It wouldn't be too useful, because Grass is special. This game does not have the physical special split, unfortunately. At least it doesn't seem like it... At least it doesn't seem like it does. Excuse me. Well, our special attack isn't too much lower than our attack, so... I guess it'd be okay. But... What was I saying? Oh yeah. At least it seems like there's no sp physical special split, because like... 
using Flame Wheel and Fire Punch with our Darumaka does fucking nothing. If it was physical, it would do a hell of a lot of damage, but it does nothing. Okay, can we get all the hits that we need? And this thing not get any hits that it needs? Go for Tickle, or go for Attract. Alright, thank you. Alright, I feel like... Mm, I'm gonna risk it. Let's let's kill it. Alright, because I wasn't sure if at minus, minus one, two hits would have killed it. And knowing my luck, we'd, we would have only got two hits. So... At minus one defense, that thing probably would have been able to do the work against us. I do want to stay in, but... We're minus one. Minus one attack and defense, not trying to catch like a wing attack or something and get bodied. So we'll just go to core and we will rock blast. We could have headbutt, say rock blast PP. Oh, well, I think after the next trainer, I will go back and heal because PP and I don't know how much more trainers are going to be on this route, which apparently there's going to be a bunch more because there's another guy over there. It's a long ass route. Well, it's not even a long route. It's just there's a lot of trainers in a row to face. Which I guess is fine because, like, it helps with grinding. But. Yeah, it sucks. Let's double slap and miss. Alright, we're at minus one attack and defense again, so we're just gonna again swap out. And core is literally the core of our team right now. Not even right now. Since we since we first caught it and grinded him up to match the to match a postman and Rosalina at the time. Ever since that point, core has been like our go-to member for anything. So I know me talking all this nice good shit about him is going to get him killed eventually, but until that happens, we can be happy about it. And that, yes, it does kill, okay. Good, good. Butterfree is coming through. I feel like we can just iron tail this thing as well. Never mind, because we missed. And we got poisoned. Exactly what I did not want to happen. We'll go to Son Goku for this one, because we resist its stab. We don't resist the confusion, we don't- we get fucking confused. Okay, break out. Oh my god. Okay, thank you. This was super risky. Hopefully it just KOs- okay. Okay, good. I was worried that it wouldn't just straight up KO. Abigail. This is Abigail, guys. That was her name. It wasn't Abigail. Oh, okay. I need to be careful. We have 30 health. Okay. How much are we at now? 22. Should be fine. Yeah, we're fine. Alright. Not trying to lose another member so soon, you know? Not after we just fucking caught it, too. Alright, let's see. How many more people are there left? Seems like this guy might be the last one. Hopefully. Nope, there's more. I kind of want to save them for, like, grinding later. What's this sign say? Flaming Root, water, Water's Cavern Ahead. Dread Swamp. Oh, there's that girl that we fought before. Don't tell me this is a rest house. Is there an item back here? Nope. Nope, nope. But this does not look like a rest house, because this looks like a fisherman, so we're going to get a rod? Yes, we got a rod. It's the old rod, so I'm probably never going to use it, because it's probably just going to have Magikarps. Which sucks. Oh wow, that's the flame, flame badge. You got it from Fiery, didn't you? Fiery is so cool. She's not just tough. People like and res people like and respect her. I want to be a gym leader like her. Okay. Stay away from the girl with the with an axe suit. 
kind of have to go that way, buddy. But we will save her for later. And deal with these last two trainers. Just to get that extra bit of grinding before we have to deal with her. Alright, oh, blah, 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 blah. Alright, good to see that we got... Ooh, Don is faster than Son Goku now. Good to see that we got these flying types, though. Because we can just roll out. I'm really mad that we only got two hits there, because if we got four, we would have killed it. And then Son Goku would have just one-shot the Pidgey. And save us some time. But Don's only getting two hits. So, what can you do? Let's go battle this last guy over here. Which, I assume he's a trainer. Phew, I better take a rest. Water's Cavern really takes a lot. I guess, I guess he's not. So we're going to go back and heal one more time. And then we will deal with the girl with the Aksu. Um, should I grind and should I like get... I want to get Dawn up to the rest of the team to because I don't feel safe. I really don't. I don't feel safe right now with this battle. Hmm. I don't. Okay, you know what? Let's grind up a little bit. Just at least get her to level 21, you know? Um, Iron Tail. As he detects, okay. Wanna at least get her one more level? Can we please just hit it? We don't even one shot? Come on. Come on, Dawn. I don't wanna use my double slaps. They're more accurate. They're more accurate, more reliable. Well, they're less, they're just as unreliable. Because if we only hit two times, then you know. But okay, we did it. And that thing didn't hit us at all. What do I want to lead with? We'll lead Son Goku. Because if it's something that we can, like, roll out against first turn, we can just, like, fuck it up. So. I forgot how she sounded. Look who's here. It's the kid who I mistakenly thought to be nothing more but more than a vessel for an evil monster. Who are you? Are you also trying to find out something about Darugus? If that's the case, we're on the same side, okay? Hmm. You know nothing about Darugus. You're only a kid. A curious kid. I seek revenge on Darugus. Revenge? Look, I don't know who the heck you are, but Darugus has my father, and I'm going to rescue him. At least you still have a family. Last time, I was merely testing you. Now let's see what you've really got. Bring it! Surprised he didn't say let's do this. I'm gonna be surprised he didn't say let's do this every time he doesn't say let's do this. So... So yeah. This, this Saturn or Mars looking bitch right here just leaves with a Larvesta. So that is something that we can roll out against. That is something we can roll out against. So that is what we are going to do. As it goes for Toxic, that actually prevents my sweep somewhat. Why does every, like, important trainer we come across have Toxic on one of their mods? Okay, this is level 21. I wonder what level her Axu is going to be, her, well, her Ace. Why is this thing so fast, too? And why is it getting crit? Now we cannot sweep at all, because we have to switch. This would have been amazing, an amazing opportunity, though. Got a fuck ton of experience, too. Sending out her Axu now. I want to go with Postman, because we can Dragon Breath. I know Axu doesn't have that great of a special attack stat. So I don't think it can Oko us. We have more than 40 health, so if he wants to Dragon Rage, we'll live it. So 
difficult decision. We can go core and be safe. But if core gets weakened, we have no nobody to switch into it. What's core special defense looking like? 22 compared to 29. And then 30. Mm. I gotta do it. What level is it? Please, it's level 24. And it's level 26. That sucks. <laughs> So we'll just Dragon Breath, which is a solid two shot, as it has Dragon Pulse. We're dead. Definitely dead. Why does it have Dragon Pulse at level 26? Fucking stupid. We had 36 speed. Minchino can outspeed him. But he won't be able to kill. Dragon Pulse again. He's probably dead too. We lived it. Yay! And now he has a Ryolu. A fighting tape. We have a normal and a rock type. All we can do is Son Goku. And we gotta hope to outspeed. And we gotta hope to Oko. We're probably not gonna outspeed because Ryolu is a fast motherfucker. And we are not gonna Oko. He has quick attack. We lived it though. We lived it. But the toxic is gonna kill us. Nope. It's not because we won. I hate this girl so much. Get the fuck out of here. I know I could have just po uh, antidoted, but I'm not thinking clearly anymore. All I see is rage. All I see is rage. Make me a red lantern because all I see is red. Lost our starter. After we just fucking gained a Pokemon. We, for some reason, cannot have more than three Pokemon on our team at one time. There we go. You know what? Well, it doesn't even matter which box is our default box because it's not like we're going to catch enough Mons to send them straight to the box. Because we only get, like, one or two encounters before the next before every city, and then we come across some broken-ass trainer that kills it right away. There was no water in that city, so we can't use the old rod there. I don't think there was any water in any of the past cities we've been to. And, like, I don't want to just go in here and continue, but I want to get an encounter first. Oh my god! Fuck off! I'm not reading it, I'm sorry. I just want to, I just want to get an encounter. She only has one Pokemon, which is great. But we let off with something that, why is it, how is it raining? We are inside. We are fucking inside. All we can do is roll out. I swear to God. I swear to God. Stop. Stop this bullshit. Stop this bullshit. I don't care if you absorb, that's fine. But stop the bullshit. I, I don't want to see any more confused Ray. I don't want to see any more flinches and any of this shit. Any of these critical hits. I don't want to see any of it. I don't want to see misses either. Stop. 
Like I'm legit I'm legitimately mad right now. Stop. Oh my god. I am going to break you. Why do we keep doing Son Goku, you fucking piece of shit. Stop hitting yourself in confusion and hit the fucking frillish. It's right in front of you. You just need to hit it like two fucking times in a row. That's it. It has nightshade, confusion, recover. I mean, confuse, rave, recover, and absorb. Doesn't matter anymore. It's fucking dead. I'm gonna go through it slowly, but I really do not feel like reading it. I just want to catch something. There's two fossils deep within. Don't even bother getting them. Too bad. I'm going to get them because I need encounters. So, yeah, we'll put Dawn in front because she's the lowest level, and let's see what we can get. There are apparently tentacle on the fucking ground in this place, and we missed the double slap. We got the Q-Charm off, we missed the double slap, watch this be the one time we get like f five fucking hits, and we get a crit. Stop. Stop. <sighs> oh, I clicked out of the game. Sorry. <sighs> Tentacle was caught. Um... Uh, no. Nope. It's gonna be Bubble Bud. No, nope, not Bub. Cause the the bubble thing he's on his head make me think of Bubble Buddy from SpongeBob. Gentle Nature, Liquid Ooze, Poison Sting, Supersonic, and Constrict. Reason I wanted to get our, our encounter first is because I wanted to be able to grind in between episodes again. And like I didn't want to have to start off next episode catching them on and then worrying about grinding it up mid episode. So at least this way I can grind it up and then ho hopefully everything is adequate by the time next episode starts. Ah. <sighs> I kind of want to run back to the last town and stuff and see if there's water. Maybe I'll do that between episodes. Huh. <sighs> because I don't remember if there was or not. But we are going to start off this next episode right here in this spot. Anyways, guys, make sure you light up the like button down below for me if you enjoy, enjoyed the, the episode and enjoyed my rage. Comment below answering the question of the day and show some feedback, support. Try to save my spirit a little bit, please. Something making me feel good. And subscribe if you want to stay updated for the next video. Have yourselves a good day, and I'll see you guys all next time.